Day, Sly and Family Stone. Great funky tune. Uh, do me a favor, don't click that subscribe button and don't hit that notification bell. Unless you think you're cool enough, then then do it. Only if you think you're cool enough, but I doubt you are. So let's get back to the uh, lesson, tutorial, or what have you. I don't really feel like I'm a teacher, but I'm gonna try to teach you something hopefully worthwhile. And hopefully it'll get a bunch of like people who are cool enough to subscribe you know and help this channel grow and help me become the man i think i am inside you know the man not man i'm a man inside I'm a man outside too whatever you know we have a girl inside my my mom did kind of like put, play with my hair and put them in like you know ponytail pigtails when i was a kid because i had like long cool hair I'm being weird again, I should just stop. Okay, let's get back to the, the guitar tutorial. <laughs> sharp major seven then to an F7 and it, it, there's no guitar parts to it it's just like the bass line going in the piano and like you just kind of hear that there it is something like that something like that so I'm trying to kind of combine that bass with like the horns and the piano, they're all kind of just doing like whatever uh, every time. But the basic, I, I, I kind of feel like there's like a something, it's like a melody that's kind of carrying along through it. It's like, <laughs> if you want me to stay, I'll be around the day to be available for to see, you know, it's like. Stay. So we're taking this funk part. And that's just the, uh, what I'm doing here is I'm holding like the major seven, which is like your A minor shape here. I'm also holding down the E string along with it. So. So, looking at the simplest form and the timing, I got one and two and three and four. One and two and three and four. And one and two and three and four. and time is kind of weird. Because like you kind of end and start on the, the same chord. So you get that one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, two, three, four, one, two. Four. So that's the timing. So you want kind of want to just like, but spice that up and jazz that up. Just like it's keeping that constant.
I think it's kind of boring. Like I also strum with my fingernail, you know, to sim simulate like the sound I can get from a pick. It's just use, I just use all, pretty much all my fingers hit the strings. And on the upstroke is my thumbnail. Downstroke is, it's primarily these two fingers, but every, they all hit, they all kind of hit. So let me try to demonstrate how I incorporate strumming with my fingernails along with the bass accompaniment. I'll try to slow that down. So you gotta develop this pattern where it's And if you want, you could just not have the bass notes in there and just play the... slow it down because it's like there's a lot going on if you're playing with the band it can be very simple like that subscribe button don't hit that notification bell so you can miss out on my next video that will bring you up to like will chamberlain level of your guitar playing live long and prosper